Laurie here from Love and Yoga. Welcome back to my channel, or if this is your first time visiting, then welcome. Thank you so much for being here. Today I'm here to take you through my favourite pregnancy stretch routine. These are all the stretches that I do to open and release through my whole body. It's very focused on the back of the body because I know lots of people get tight backs backs in pregnancy, I definitely do, so that's where I do a lot of my stretching. And it's also focused on the hips because we want those hips to be open and relaxed during pregnancy so that that will help us when it comes to birth and labour. At the time of filming this, I'm currently 33 weeks pregnant with my second baby, so I'm well into the third trimester now. I'm definitely feeling those third trimester aches and pains. So these are the stretches that I need to be doing every single day now to make my body feel relaxed and less achy. So if you are feeling a little bit icky at the moment in your body, you're in the right place. Clear yourself a space and let's get started. All right, guys, we're starting today's practice on all fours. So come on round and make sure you're comfortable here. Starting from a long flat back, we're gonna to begin to round back through the spine and then come back to our flat back. So on the exhale, you're round, looking to your belly and on the inhale, you're lengthen. Just moving through roughly six to eight of these in your own time, in your own way. And just breathing deeply into each movement. Awesome. All right, from there, let's go ahead and start to draw great big circles with our whole body. So we're rolling all the way forwards and then all the way backwards as if you're trying to press your bottom all the way over your heels each time. This is just a really nice way to release through the back of the body and release through your spine. So have a good old wiggle here and make sure again that you're breathing really deeply as you do this to help your body open and to help your whole body to relax. Start to just wiggle those hips from side to side instead of drawing big circles, just to release through the tailbone. And then from there, we're gonna step our right leg through to the top end of the mat. Keep that left knee down. You can grab a block or a book to lean on like I am here. And then we'll just begin to gently pulse those hips forwards and backwards. Again, in your own time, in your own way, no rush here. And I really recommend just moving as slowly as possible with these pulses. It's just a really nice way to begin to open through the midsection of the pelvis and through your hips. From here, we're gonna extend that right leg forwards, coming into a hamstring and calf stretch by lifting the toes high towards the sky. Keep the body lifted on your block if you're using one, otherwise hands can be down on the ground. No force, we don't wanna overstretch in pregnancy, but we definitely wanna work all the way through the back of the leg. Gently release from there. Head back through all fours so you can bring your other leg, your left leg through. We're coming back into our lunge position, leaning on the block or your book, and then just gently rocking forwards and backwards. And just focusing on deep breaths in and out here. All right, let's begin to press those hips back into our hamstring and calf stretch. Again, just keep really lifting those left toes high towards the sky so you can feel that stretch all the way through the back of the leg. I don't know about you, but my calf muscles get so tight in pregnancy. So I absolutely love this one to help me release my calf muscles. All right, let's 
let's slowly begin to release. We're gonna come all the way back into child's pose now. So toes together, knees nice and wide. Sink your belly down towards the ground, arms reaching in front of you. Now you can do this one leaning on a great big cushion or a bolster if you have one, especially if you feel like your tummy is too close to the ground at this point. And you can even lift your arms up higher, resting on forearms if flattening the body down feels too much. Just focus on your breath, nice deep breaths in and out as you relax through the whole body. All right, slowly release. Walk your whole body back up and transition round now onto your bottom with the soles of the feet together and the knees falling wide to the sides of your mat. This is Baddha Konasana, my favorite hip stretch for pregnancy. It's a really, really great one to get those hips open and ready for birth. So let's just take a few really deep breaths here. Imagine you're sending that breath all the way down to your hips each time. You can feel those hips open and relax. If you did want more, feel free to gently fold the body down towards your feet. But if this feels too much for any reason, just come back up. rise on up and take your left leg out to the side of the room you're going to reach your right arm all the way up and over towards your left leg so we come into this really yummy side stretch to open through the side of the body and also through the inner thigh if it's too much with that top arm lifted just wrap it behind your back instead that's for all you suffering with your blood pressure at the moment that option will feel more comfortable all right let's start to reach away from the leg now sweeping that left arm up and over and then head on back towards your leg right arm over again sweep away and cartwheel over the leg awesome just keep that coming in your own time in your own way Feeling really nice and relaxed in your own body here and really focusing on those lovely deep breaths into the side of the body to help you open and to help you relax. Alright, slowly release from there. Let's bring that left leg in and take our right leg out to the side of the room now, sitting nice and tall. And when you're ready, we're gonna reach that left arm all the way up and over towards our right leg. Just let yourself settle into the side stretch, opening through the rib cage, through the side of the body. Just allow yourself to breathe deeply. Again, that option to wrap that top arm behind you is there if you need it, especially if you're suffering with blood pressure issues. All right, let's start to reach away. So the right arm sweeps up and over and then back towards the leg, left arm. And again, just keeping that coming, reaching away and then reaching towards your leg. Again, just follow your own rhythm here. It really doesn't matter if you're doing this much slower or much quicker than me. This is all about us just listening to our own bodies and just feeling whatever feels good in our pregnant bodies right now. your last one. Let's come 
come on out of our side stretch now. And let's come to a yummy cross leg position if this suits your knees. We'll bring the hands onto our knees and then take an inhale, sweep arms high. Exhale, hands meet at heart center. Again, inhale, reach high. Exhale, heart center. And again, inhale, reach. Exhale, heart center. One more, inhale, we reach. Exhale to your heart space. Hold it back. Nice deep breaths. And then we'll pop the hands down onto the knees and start to draw some really lovely circles with the torso. So you can make this movement as big or as small as you like. You're just rolling the body all the way forwards and backwards to release through the spine. And just change direction whenever it feels right for you. Stay with your breath. Get the whole upper body loose in here. to seated cat cow so we lift through the spine eyes can look up and then we exhale round through the spine look down towards the belly just keep that coming lifting the chest and then rolling the body forwards just make your way back to seated we'll take one more big breath in as we reach the arms up high exhale through to your heart space holding it there as we end our practice today hopefully feeling a little bit more open in your body a little more relaxed and if you need any more time you could just spend a few more breaths here just taking some quiet time to yourself but I'm going to leave you here. Thank you so much for joining me for today's practice. And good luck with the rest of your pregnancy journey. And there we go. Thank you so much for joining me for today's pregnancy stretch routine. I really hope you enjoyed these stretches and I hope your body is feeling really, really good now. You'll have to let me know down in the comments how you got on. If you did enjoy this video, please do give it a big thumbs up, leave me a comment, come say hi, and click that subscribe button to join the Lemon Yoga family. I would love to have you here. I will see you next time. Bye!